If you're considering buying a house or are already starting to look for homes, you may have heard the terms pre-qualified and pre-approved. So what do these terms mean and is there really any difference? Hi, my name is Greg Davis with Vanguard Realty Alliance and today I'll be explaining the difference and why you need to be pre-approved instead of just pre-qualified if you want to buy a house in this market. As a prospective home buyer, it's important to know the difference because not knowing might be a huge mistake that ends up costing you thousands of dollars. First, you'll need to understand that being pre-qualified by a mortgage lender is not the same as being pre-approved and that pre-qualification is not a true approval. Pre-qualification is actually just the initial step in the mortgage approval process where you get together with the loan officer to discuss your income and financial situation and if everything seems to be okay, the lender may issue a pre-approval letter and you're probably thinking it's time to start looking at houses, but don't forget, nothing has actually been verified yet. To move from being pre-qualified to becoming pre-approved, you'll need to provide the lender with all the necessary documentation. These are things like paycheck stubs, copies of bank statements, tax returns for the past two years, and statements for investments and retirement funds, etc. Once the lender has truly verified everything you'll need in order to be approved for a mortgage loan, at that point they'll definitely be able to let you know how much you would be approved for, which loan product is the best option for you, and provide you with a better idea of interest rate. Just a quick note here to say that interest rate isn't locked at this point, and the rate lock occurs a bit later in the process. It's essential that you go through the process to get pre-approved before going under contract on the home of your dreams. Otherwise, you could potentially lose your initial deposit and any money that you spend on things like inspections or the appraisal. And quite honestly, in this market, with multiple offers on properties, you probably won't even get the house because a buyer with a pre-approval is stronger than one that's only been pre-qualified. Don't let your excitement to find that home of your dreams allow you to fall into that trap. Always work with a qualified professional to walk you through the safest and most strategic way to become a homeowner. And don't forget, it's free to have an agent represent you. The seller may pay my fees, but I'm here to look out for you and to protect your best interests. If you found this information helpful, please subscribe to my YouTube channel where you can find other helpful videos. I love where I live and I want you to love where you live too, so remember to reach out. I'd love nothing more than to have the opportunity to be your personal compass guiding you to that special place you'll want to call home.